XXOO Glow Fam, Vince here, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. As always, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and hit that little notification bell so that you are always updated. All the products used in this video will be listed down below, and if you are buying any, don't forget to tag me on Instagram at XXOO Vince with the hashtag Vince made me buy this. You can follow me on all my social media accounts, everything will be up here and linked down below. Also, be part of the Glow Fam group chat Facebook community by clicking on the link down below. In today's video, Glow Fam, we will be doing another versus, and this time, yung gagawin natin is full coverage versus natural look. Ipapakita ko sa inyo kung ano yung mga favorite foundations na ginagamit ko on both kind of looks. So what are you waiting for? Grab a drink, sit back, and relax, and without further ado, let's glow! Let's dive in, Glow Fam. So as you all know, before I even started the video, I already washed my face using the Lana PH Activated Charcoal Soap. Lagi kong ginagabit yung soap na yun kasi sobrang nakaklense niya talaga yung skin ko and sobrang love ko lang. <laughs> After that, I also cleansed my face using the Lana PH Soothe and Hydrate Gentle Cleanser. Yung combination na dalawang yun, perfect talaga for my daily routine, hindi hindi mawawala yun. If you're buying any products from Lana PH, don't forget to use code VINCE5 for 5% off upon checkout. Just visit www.lana.ph or you can also check them out on Instagram at lana.ph. Now, Glowfam, to start our makeup game, we are using the Lana PH DNA Repair Elixir. Kahit ano mga okasyon, kahit ano mga lakad ko, hindi hindi mo wala to sa routine ko. Kasi alam kong super duper hydrated yung face ko pag ginagamit ko tong DNA Repair Elixir, super favorite ko talaga siya. After that, of course, we are using the Lana PH 100% Pure Argan Oil. Actually, yung skin type ko combination siya, dry and oily. Pero gumagamit pa rin ako ng argan oil kasi iba talaga yung benefits ng argan oil para sa skin natin. Lalo na if acne prone yung skin mo, tapos meron kang mga hyperpigmentation, this would definitely be good for you. Again, don't forget to use code VINCE5 for 5% off upon checkout. Now to complete the priming game, we are using the Quick Effects No Shine Mattifier. Alam nyo, Glow Fam, recently ko lang naging favorite to. Simula nung lagi ko na siyang ginagamit. Pag pinapartner ko to dun sa argan oil, syempre oil yun diba? Tapos ito mattifier. So hindi nagiging sobrang dry yung skin ko. Hindi siya super matte. Nagmumukha lang radiant yung skin ko. Kita nyo naman meron pa rin siyang slight glow and yun yung gusto kong ma-achieve. Ayoko na magmukhang sobrang matte because nagmumukhang parang dry na dry yung skin ko eh. Now let's really dive in into foundation. Actually dito sa vlog na to, foundation lang yung review natin. So on this side, we will be doing the natural looking glow or yung medyo sheer to medium coverage na foundation. Kung paano siya ina-apply para ma-achieve mo yung natural glow na yun. And on this side, we will be doing the full coverage foundation. I think hindi ko na kailangan explain sa inyo kung ano yung full coverage. Siguro alam na alam nyo na yun. Kung gusto nyo ng plakadong-plakadong mukha, full coverage yun. So magsisimula tayo sa mga ginagamit kong foundation pag gumagawa ko ng mga natural glow na itsura. So first, sisimula natin sa super duper favorite ko, yung Maybelline New York Fit Me Foundation in the shade 228 or Soft Tan. This one is a matte finish foundation. Hindi naman siya sobrang sheer. Actually, Actually, medium to full coverage siya. Pag binild up mo pa siya, pwede siyang maging full coverage. Pero pag yung initial layer lang inilagay mo, medium coverage lang siya. Which is good kapag gusto mo ng mga natural glam, ng mga day-to-day -day look. Perfect na perfect tong foundation na to para sa mga oily na tao. Pero yun lang, kapag ginamit mo tong foundation na to on your face, huwag mong i-expect na magkakaroon ka ng slight glow. Yung parang radiant yung itsura kasi matte talaga siya. Now, another foundation that I would like to recommend is yung L'Oreal Paris and 24-hour fresh wear foundation in the shade 140 or golden beige. Yung pinakaiba naman ng foundation na to, this one, yung finish niya, it's not matte. Medyo dewy yung itsura nyo. So, mas ma-achieve nyo yung natural glow na gusto nyo makuha. However, itong foundation na to is sheer. Well, perfect siya for a day-to-day -day look. However, if maraming pimple marks yung face mo, like for example, ganito, kapag nilapatan mo siya nitong foundation na to, hindi siya makocover up talaga. As in, medyo magpipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipipip
year. So, unang-unang favorite ko, kapag full coverage yung gusto kong makuha, is yung Maybelline New York Superstay 24-hour full coverage foundation in the shade 310 or sun beige. Ito, try to test it ko na talaga to. Hindi talaga ako ipapahiya nito. However, katulad nga nung Maybelline Fit Me Foundation, matte din yung finish nito. So, magmumukhang parang plakadong matte talaga yung face mo. Pero, itong foundation na to, love na love ko to. Promise. Next one, I have the NYX HD Studio Photogenic Foundation in the shade Sand Beige. Itong shade na to, hindi ko masyadong ginagamit, pero maganda yung coverage niya. As in, full coverage din siya. Kasi medyo maputi yung nakuha kong shade. Sabi ko na nga, huwag kayo order ng foundation sa Lazada hanggat di nyo pa natatry. Kasi, akala nyo shade nyo, pero hindi nyo pala shade. So, very wrong yun. So, bumuli rin ako ng NYX Total Control Drop Foundation in the shade Mocha. So, itong dalawang to, full coverage siya, definitely. So, minimix ko lang siya if I wanted to achieve yung parang skin tone ko talaga. I have another brand na gusto kong sabihin sa inyo na full coverage din siya. Actually, medium to full coverage siya, pero leaning on the full coverage side. Kaya ako siya nilagay dito sa side na to. This is the Ever Bolena All Day Liquid Foundation. I have the shades Oriental and Olive. Apparently, these are the deepest or the darkest shades that they have. They only have five shades dito sa Ever Bolena All Day Liquid Foundation. Pero apparently, yung deepest or darkest shade nila is maputi pa rin for my skin tone. Hindi ko alam kung bakit, ano bang problema sa Ever Bolena. Kailangan nilang imulat yung mata nila na, hello, nasa Pilipinas tayo. Maraming mga morena at morena dito. So, I hope, I really, really hope na maglabas sila ng mas deep or darker shades dito sa mga foundation na to kasi kung porcelain na yung kutis mo I'm sure magagamit mo to perfect na perfect to pero kung moreno ka like me ako nga medyo hindi naman ako deep moreno parang ano lang mid-tone moreno lang ako hindi naman sobrang moreno hindi rin sobrang maputi pero yung darkest shade maputing maputi na sa akin so it's a no for me but nung tinry ko yung formula niya the formula is good very lightweight siya tapos leaning on to full coverage na nga siya so maganda siya kaso lang yun lang yung downside niya. Tapos, yung shades. So, please, Ever Belena, limang shades pa. Okay na. Limang shades na lang. Baka sakaling mahit natin yung hinahanap ng mga totoong moreno. So, on this side, we will be using the Maybelline Superstay 24-hour full coverage foundation. And on this side, we are using the L'Oreal Paris Infallible 24-hour fresh wear foundation. So, magsisimula muna ako dito sa side ng natural glow or natural glam. Now, Glow Fam, pag natural glam yung ginagawa ko, dinirect ako na agad sa sponge, yung foundation. So, maglalagay lang ako ng two pumps. Tapos, ibabounce ko na siya sa skin ko. Kasi if you're going for a natural glam, mas maganda na nilalagay mo na sa sponge kasi mas maraming na-absorb na product. So, hindi magiging cakey yung itsura ng foundation mo. One more thing pala dito sa L'Oreal Paris na to. Maling shade na naman yung nakuha ko. As usual, binili ko siya sa Lazada. So, pinapakita ko lang sa inyo yung natural glow pag foundation yung nilalagay ko. Pag sheer lang. Pero, wag nyo na i-mind yung shade kasi sobrang puti talaga nito for me. Pero alam nyo, pag nakuha ko talaga yung perfect shade ko dito sa L'Oreal Paris Infallible na to, I think sobrang magagamit ko siya palagi kasi sobrang ganda ng formula niya, ang lightweight, sheer lang yung coverage niya, tapos medyo dewy yung finish niya, kaya yun yung gusto ko dun. So normally, pag natural glam lang ginagawa ko, ilalagay ko siya using a sponge, tapos gagamitin ko yung clean side of the sponge, ibabuff ko pa siya para mas mabawasan pa ng konti yung coverage ng foundation kasi ayaw naman natin magmukhang happy foundation day kung natural glam lang naman yung gusto natin ma-achieve. Now that we are done applying the foundation, kita nyo naman na hindi naman siya sobrang matte. Medyo meron siyang konting-konting glow. And yun yung gusto ko sa foundation na to. So regardless, kahit di ko to ka-shade, I highly recommend the formula. Ang ganda niya. Sana makuha ko na yung shade ko. Ipon-ipon pa. And now on this side, yun nga gagamitin natin tong Maybelline New York Super State 24-hour full coverage foundation. So ang gagawin muna natin, nilalagay muna natin sa back of our hand. Two pumps muna if we need more. Sige, dagdagan natin. Pero for now, let's work on this muna. So, ilalagay ko muna siya using a flat brush to make sure na evenly distributed yung product. Kaya dito ko nilagay yung full coverage kasi gusto ko talaga makita nyo na tatakpan niya talaga yung mga pimple marks ko. So, how can we make a full coverage foundation work? So, first, if you wanted the coverage to stay on your face, use a brush. Bakit brush yung ginagamit natin pag full coverage foundation? Kasi hindi siya nag absorb ng ganong karaming product compared to using a sponge. So, ang ginagawa lang natin, we're just making sure that everything is blended out first using the brush kahit na magkaroon kayo ng streaks kung di man ganun kaganda yung brush na ginagamit nyo pwede nyo siyang i-buff out later using a damp sponge pero yung initial application ng foundation nyo you can use a brush para ma-evenly distribute yung foundation dun sa gusto nyong 
cover na skin. So ngayon pa lang hindi niyo na nakikita yung pimple marks ko, which definitely proves na full coverage talaga ng foundation na to. And yun yung gustong gusto ko sa kanya. Kung gusto mo magmukhang manikin, go for full coverage. Kung gusto magmukhang plakado, go for full coverage. So ang ginagawa ko, dinadab and swipe ko lang yung brush para hindi naman sobrang mawala yung foundation. Now that you have the foundation laid down, you can get a damp sponge tapos i-buff mo lang siya para magkaroon ka pa rin ng parang airbrush finish na nabibigay lang talaga ng damp sponge. And that's it! Kitang-kita nyo this side, medyo kita pa rin yung ibang pimple marks kasi nga sheer lang ginamit ang foundation. Pero on this side, sobrang plakadong-plakado yung foundation natin. Dito maraming pimple marks kanina pero hindi na siya nagsishow up kasi nga full coverage yung ginamit nating foundation. So that's it for today's video, Glow Fam. Let me know your thoughts. Team full coverage ba kayo or team natural glow? Please sound off down below hashtag team full coverage or hashtag team natural glow. Ilagay nyo na rin kung ano yung favorite nyong foundation. Wala man yun dun sa mga nirecommend ko. Isulat nyo na lang dun sa description box para matry ko rin naman siya in the future. Before I even go, I'd like to give a few XXL shoutouts. First shoutout goes to John Clint L. Melendez. John Clint is also a startup YouTuber like me. Beauty guru din siya. And meron siyang YouTube channel. I'll definitely put his link down below. The next shoutout that I'd like to give would go to Sai Isla. Sai Isla is a really great makeup artist. Makeup enthusiast din siya. Makeup junkie din siya. Ang galing niyang mag-makeup. Maganda siya magawa ng mga natural looks. If you want to check her out, I'll put her details down below. That's it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. XXOO Glow Fam, and I'll see you on the next one.